Frank was talking a little bit about Joe Spinell's look in the original yeah. film, and he's really disgusting. And I, you know, not what? just because no, he's you're not. here. He's beautiful. His eyes. <laughs> not just because poetry you're in here, them. but you are not so disgusting. <laughs> so, no. Can you talk a little bit though about how you interpreted the character? It's a fine line. I mean, I think that I was aware of the fact that I, I, I'm not Joe Spinell, and and I was not at all going to try and attempt to do anything that that what he had done. Um, that you know, essentially creating the character was creating the character from a fresh perspective. So I actually didn't see, I hadn't seen the original oh. film um, until we started shooting. Oh, okay. Which I think by the time that we started shooting, I thought, well, I'll wait until we've already kind of established the character because I didn't really want to use it as a reference point. Um, but you know, it was important to me that we, f we strike a balance between the character being disturbing and on mm. some levels mm -hmm. that being visually represented. But, but there's also, a vulnerability, right? But yeah, and he has to be somewhat um, accessible too. We have to believe as an audience that he can spend time with these women and that there aren't massive alarm bells going off. <laughs> exactly. Um, and maybe even a chance to change. Like, there might be a chance. And exactly. In any of these moments, maybe, mm -hmm. if the but demons don't be, catch up. There could you know, be redemption for Right, him. rather than Patrick Bateman or something, who's just like, I'm gonna, you know. Totally. Yeah. So that was really important on a vi on, from a visual perspective. Um, and for me, just to find the, the, the tonalities and the levels of humanity that we could, that we could explore as well without making him overly sympathetic. I mean, I, I think it's a it's a danger that that modern horror has gotten into, specifically with remakes, where they try and and almost um, the, the the new perspective is to give a backstory to oh, our famous right. killers, Leather which is face, such a you know, it's that's a right. nightmare he's, because the thing like is that it, it robs. And, yeah. Well, it robs those characters of what made them scary to begin with, mm -hmm. and I, I think you know, and maybe it tarnishes the original in a weird way because oh. you start going, "Oh, that's the backstory to the right. classic." A yeah. bit. And horror you know, films, it's... fans are really savvy, and and when they feel like they're being forced to feel something, especially sympathy, it, it just doesn't it doesn't resonate, and I think it's not necessarily organic. So that was really important that any of that come from a place of organics within the context of the character. Please.